Hey guys, gals, and legionnaires, Rykon here, and welcome back to Let's Relax with RimWorld, episode 28. We survived another raid yesterday. And, well, it was tribal people, but they gave us a bit of a hard time. They, well, they actually did some pretty good damage to Noah. In fact, she took a peeler to the arm and uh, damaged her pretty well. But um, it's been patched up, if not badly, by Logan. And hopefully we should see her on the men very soon. This episode, I'm going to make 100% sure that this heater gets built so that we can get the temperature rising in here. Because this cold snap's been around for way longer than I thought it was going to. Uh, yeah. Sano has just come back from visiting poor Sonic. Oh, I like the music. It was just very, it was nice, it was very wintry. Um, Sano and, and Chip, you're kind of still roommates at the moment. Um, we probably won't be expanding. Oh, the cold snap's over. Okay, well thank you, but it's still going to be pretty cold, I'm imagining. <laughs> Oh dear. Logan is heading down here to actually get this built. But uh, yeah, that still needs to be constructed. You can move past that heater, can't you? Yes, you can. Good. It's Oh, it's actually powered already. Were we, oh, you were getting a power directly from there. That's right. Okay, we don't actually... Damn it. We didn't need to do those. Oh well. I should have remembered you yeah, when I put it down. There was a line that was running there. Okay, all right, you're trying to get to 21 degrees, so let's see how that manages with these two. We'll see how this corridor kind of gets down. Low food, yeah, well, we're going to change that. We do have many more people than we did before, so I need to I need to try and keep on top of the idea that uh, we are going to need a lot more food. Uh, even things like squirrels, that's one meal probably. Oh, it sounds like um, Noah's actually out hunting already. Yep down here hunting deer hopefully getting better at shooting at the same time it could be also that this gun isn't actually a no it's actually pretty good condition your shooting is good as well it's 10 yeah she learns bit by bit I just don't know why she has to shoot on the very edge of her range. Because they keep on walking out of range. Yeah, two shots will kill them. Hopefully they did it. The frozen coast. Alright, oh, Logan. Looks like we might actually get this turret base made. We can chuck that RPG on it. Be about time. We look at what making a few of the different turrets as well. A few different options for what we can do there. Looks like one went on the food basket, but I don't really think they're being used. It is nice to think that we can have like things stored in baskets and the rest. Just looks a little bit more appealing to the eye. And it looks like you are going to need some more off these bars. Uh, I could be clearing snow out here, but we don't actually have to go outside for too much. So I don't think we're going to really worry about it too much at this stage. We probably will in time. How's our temperature going? Two degrees. Wow. Far out. That's revolutionary. <laughs> yeah, this probably isn't having to work too hard to keep this cool. Yep, current power usage is low. I imagine it'd be very low. Oh dear, poor sheep. There's nothing left of sheep at all. Not a bit. Yeah. Alright, Logan. A little bit further to go. Well, you're going to go over rest. All good by me. Yeah, this bar production is still not super quick. Uh, we do have our craftsman's table finished, being deconstructed. So let's go and chuck in our powered crafting table right there. And that means we can actually get rid of this at the same time. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's going to give us room for other things. Actually, no, we, we don't need to deconstruct it just yet, um, but we probably will, um, as it's being replaced by this. Although, yeah, actually, no, we will we'll deconstruct it, otherwise they will try and use it. 
Chip is doing some hauling, which is perfect. Glad to see that. You're going to be our grave digger today. Getting rid of the empath. Oh, actually, but oh, I thought the empath was actually wearing a whole heap of stuff, but that was actually uh, Chip. Yeah. If there are any bodies up there that do have things on them, though, I don't know. I don't think so. Yeah, so these the these are the pre transcendents. We can see that their bodies look different. They have these I guess they could be implants actually. Advanced bionic air. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wonder if we can uh wonder if we can remove those. Hmm, interesting. There probably is a way for us to surgically remove those. I'll be interested to see if they have any bionics as well. Silent jaw implant. Talking efficiency, 100%. Holy crap. Hang on, wait. Yeah, you're dead. But I was like, hypothermia? What? <laughs> Shivering? Suffering from bruises? Um, yeah, there's got to be a way to cut those things out. I don't know if we need a special workstation to be able to do that. Um, or whether they have to be alive when we take them out, I'm not sure. But, okay, winter's here. Because it wasn't actually here before, that was just the build-up to it. My sweet summer child, that was me. Thinking that winter was already here. Nope, nope, that was just the start of it. Winter, <laughs> winter's yet to actually show its face. Oh dear. Well, the temperature inside is growing. I think that we might need another heater. Um, it doesn't seem to be able to get above 4 degrees currently. So I think we might have to look at constructing one more. And I think we'll probably construct it down here. Let the heat kind of dissipate. Because it's not really getting to these rooms well enough. Well, as much as I'd like. So, let's see. Well, if we do it up here, it's going to be connected right away. So, let's do that for now. It is going to use more of those blocks, though. More of those blocks which we're needing to use elsewhere. Yeah, well, we're needing the bars there as well, as well as here, and... We're just needing a hell of a lot more bars all around. Actually, and we're slowly starting to run out of, um... Steel down there, so we might need, uh... Might need some more mining to start happening. Yikes. Well, we have had a bit of hauling going on. RPG's actually in... Pretty bad condition. Yeah. I'll be interested to see how good it can fire. How much meat we're we getting from those? Uh, it's an it's an okay amount. It's not crazy. It's not too bad at the same time. You're gonna head on down here. Have a pray, eh? Sure thing, buddy. Senna, what are you up to? Gonna come and rest. I'd love to get your room chip, but uh, yeah. <laughs> right now, it's not looking like we're going to be able to. We're hunkering down. Yep, see this temperature just ain't cutting it. It's still a priority of ours to get this temperature up because um, I'm surprised we aren't catching more colds. Thought we would have been. Still concerned about food. Should still have some of those deer around. Yeah, we do. We still have two marked. And one of them is actually almost dead already. No, I just didn't quite finish it off. Wow, we got a sunny day. Nice. Feels like it's been a while since we've actually had a nice sunny day. Yeah. Not fully recovered, are we? Not yet. It looks like something Leon, the Leon is wearing is going to fall apart any second. I think it's actually that, that yeah, it's that Parker. Crap. Although in saying that, um, there are some fresh Parkers up here that we can take. Which um, I think we will get straight onto. You're 38% and you are 60%. Okay, cool. I'm going to get Leon to come up here and do that now. Stop cooking for the time being. Swap it out. Oh, well, it has power. And it just needs more steel bars. Looks like we're going to get part of that constructed. 
So we don't need any more planks for the time being. We've got more than enough currently. We've actually got more than enough blocks as well. A lot of different kinds of blocks. You really need to repair those? Yeah, I guess it being damaged ever so slightly. It does mean that there's no other construction you can do for the time being. And it looks like we are actually going to have to do some more mining. Damn, okay. Who is on our mining crew? Right now, no one. And Gwyn is researching away, that's good. Logan, how are you for mining? Four. Noah's actually pretty good at mining. Well, if she's not hunting, I'd like her to be mining. Because we are going to need a lot more steel. Oh, you're tired. But, you're bringing it back. Good work. I'd like to see that place down too. But, it's not going to happen right now. Actually, we, we do have enough to build it. Uh, you're actually hauling that to the heater. That's good. Let's get the chop down this right in the way. As is that. Thought they would have died by now. I thought most of these things would have died. It's actually taking a little bit longer for the uh, grass in here to die off than I would have thought. Go back for the rest of those blocks, buddy. <laughs> there should be enough there. Mm, no, you're going to go and... He's trying to mine meld with hedgehogs. What? <laughs> is this because of Sonic being missing, Logan? That you're trying to mine meld with hedgehogs? There's no more hedgehogs around, buddy. I'm sorry they're gone. They're creatures of warmer weather. They've given up on this place. Looks like old ships head out there to go and say hi to Sonic. Fortescue's Tower. Well, we rescued Seno from them. Seno was originally from from there. You can see we're actually consuming quite a bit of that battery power. We might have to look at uh, bumping another wind turbine into the mix. Well, that's kind of why we left this area open and built it on the sand because nothing else is kind of going to grow in its path. Let's see what these visitors say. Ooh, woohoo. Okay. I'm really interested to see how much uh, that helps us out. It is such a large area for it to be heating, though. I, I can understand why it would be struggling. At least the temperatures are getting a little bit better inside these rooms. At least it's, well, it's not freezing, and that's making a change. Okay. Well, it was looking good. <laughs> So I don't think we need it to be 21 degrees. I think I would be okay with it being 15 degrees. Because it's not cold. Whoops, 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 whoops. Okay. Yeah, let's get that up to 15. You, I think we'll sit you at, yeah, we'll sit you at 15 as well. Although how that translates into those rooms, we'll, we'll see. Logan doing some more repairing. I'm not going to worry about um, building this fence again just yet. We will build it in time, um, but we don't need it right now. Yeah, we need a lot more. A lot more steel bars. Just all the time. So we are actually going to have to get some of that mining done. Hey, there's a whole heap of them. They seem to be a pretty medieval society, Fortescue's Tower. At least that's the way it seems. Decent amount of steel weapons. Not bad. Andy seems to be leading them in here. Carrying a steel glaive. Well, I say in here, but they don't seem to actually be coming inside. Guess they're just passing through. Okay, well, that's a quick visit. See you later. Thanks for stopping by. Ah, oh, Chip. Not the best confu- Oh, okay. Now, I think this is just because of her dementia. Seno is pretty old. Um, yeah. But um, she'll come back. It's okay. 
We'll just wander around for now. Have some time off, because if we actually have a look at her mood... It's actually... Oh, actually... Whoa, her break is really, really low. No, that's just, that's just the halfway point, I think. Yeah, 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 no. no. So that's not the threshold. Not close to it all. Temperature? Two degrees. Still not high enough. I mean, it's also combating this because it's so close to being outside. It's going to really struggle to keep that temperature up. And it does seem to be struggling. Wowzers. Okay, let's see. Power conduit. We are going to need to get some down here. Hmm. Yeah, it's going to have to be a direct connection. Close to. If we can get it to that point, it should be okay. We'll see, it might have to go further down. Because I think it's, what was it, one, two... One, two, three. Yeah, so actually we need to go a little bit further. Yeah, this should be fine. Close enough, at least. Alright, now we're laying down some bars. Ah, uh, we still don't have this up, though. We've placed some bars into it. Not enough, though. We don't have enough bars there, either. Logan's actually going to get his craft on. Alright. Yeah, and Noah's going to get to mining. Oh, she's a decent miner. Chip is hauling. Good to see. It's going to make it much easier for us to... Well, it's going to make it easier for us to make things, having it close at hand. That power usage is going up. I think dropping another one of these in as well is going to make us... Uh, going to consume even more power. You know, because of the amount of rooms here, it almost would be okay just to chuck these goddamn heaters in the rooms um, and just heat them directly, but I was really wanting to get the ventilation system going so that we didn't have to worry about doing that. If we got bigger heaters, it would be okay, and I think that's what we're going to do eventually, have kind of heating systems. This is why these vents are here. But, yeah, I don't know. I'm almost tempted to get rid of these chairs and the rest now because I don't want them to come and relax socially up here. So we're just, just going to mark all that stuff to be deconstructed. Yeah, we don't want that. We don't want them doing that. What are you doing? Cleaning up. Well, yeah, there is quite a bit of rubble there. Fair enough. You're doing a good job. Okay, more bars being produced, just still not enough. Now, if I had the other station going, we would be able to do this a lot faster. Uh, but it does take more bars to do that as well, so... Kind of stuck. Stuck in this limbo at the moment. Of not having enough bars. Never having enough. Alright. I think Noah's still relaxing. You're pretty joyful. Yeah, go do some more mining. Good call. This Seno is actually cleaned a hell of a lot. Making it look all better. And all of this is lit up now, which is nice. The colony is actually, you know, we can see it from far away. No, it's working pretty hard, but it takes a bit to get through that steel. Yeah, that needs to be a higher priority for her. In terms of her work at the moment. It's now a number one priority. Crafting is now number two. Yeah. There we go. Actually, Chip is getting some of those potatoes inside. And that's all our food. All the food that we had grown. Packed away into the freezer. We didn't get nearly as much as I was hoping. But, um, yeah. <laughs> Damn. We will do better next year, if we survive the winter, that is. Uh, it still remains to be seen. This is going to be a long and a hard one for us, I imagine. Low on medicine, low on food. 
it's going to hate, it's going to be pretty difficult for us to eke out an existence here, but we're doing okay so far. Not the end of the world for us. We might actually have to just look at um, chucking an actual bed in here for a chip for the time being, because I'm not really up for expanding much further right now. So I think we're just going to have to share this room a little bit. I would like to get a medical ward in eventually as well. I think a lot of the a lot of the advancements we're going to do are kind of kind of be out this way a little bit more and out this way. We're going to leave this side for farming. I'm going to kind of redesign that a little bit, have it be a little bit more symmetrical work for the place. We'll see how we do. And come summer, I'd like to open up this roof as well. I'm like trying to kind of try and think of it as being a retractable roof. Um, although in saying that, we've got so many electrical things there now. Um, it would probably be a bad idea. Yeah, <laughs> it would be actually a very bad idea. When we just tear through those bars really quick. What are you doing? What are you hauling those blocks for? Construction. Hey, I won't complain about that. Further advancements in construction. Unlock research for industrial heating and cooling solutions. Industrial. All right. Also unlocks heated floors, conduit walls, and powered doors to speed your class along their merry way. Okay, let's drop back to the research screen, and let's see. We don't really need to worry about heated floors or anything like that just yet. Mining might actually be good to get now. I was wanting to kind of go along uh, this a little bit further, but um, yeah, before power and before security, we might need to up our mining get an increase in speed. Hell, even that pick would help us. Mining speed plus 20%, so that'd be a 40% increase to our speed. That's not bad. Not bad. We do need more food cooked, so I think it would be... I think it'd be best. Oh, damn. There we go. Power outages already. Oh, damn. Yep, we're going to need some more steel bars because, um, yeah, this, this is not good. Not good at all. And we're going to be drawing more power now that we have this up and running as well. Yikes. That's a problem. That's a big problem. We need wind. <laughs> we need it badly. So let's pray for some and hope next time we get some. I hope you'll join me then. I've been Rykon. You've been awesome. And until next time. Stay tuned.